The Lee Metcalf is essentially an island of wilderness in a sea of development. Celebrating 30 years as a wilderness area, the Lee Metcalf has remained untouched during those three decades, while the surrounding community continues to grow. Since the time that the Lee Metcalf was designated, the Gallatin Valley has almost doubled in population. The Wilderness Act was designed to allow sections of the country to remain undeveloped by us. And now, decades later, with this bird's eye view, you can see firsthand how this act has protected the Lee Metcalf. By taking this unique perspective from the sky, it gives you the opportunity to look at more than 200,000 acres of wilderness in just a matter of minutes. It takes 90 seconds to fly over the Lee Metcalf from west to east. The Lee Metcalf itself is 255,000 acres divided up into four separate units. And those four units were created for political reasons, allowing a snowmobile trail from West Yellowstone to Big Sky and the harvesting of lumber. Well, we care about the environment. That's why we do it. And we've also recognized as pilots the added perspective that flight can bring to an issue. President of the nonprofit EcoFlight, Bruce Gordon, is proud to offer the unique perspective of looking down upon areas like the Lee Metcalf. I've flown all over the world, and truly the American West is as, is as special and unique as any place I've ever been. You can't find any greater freedom than being in a wilderness area right now. Reporting from over the Lee Metcalf Wilderness Area, celebrating its 30th year, I'm Adam Bell, MTN News.